Hi everyone, I'm Jung Jun Park, and I'm presenting our new work, Seeing the World in a Bag of Chips. This work was done in collaboration with Alex and Steve. A video of a bag of chips contains specular highlights, and although not readily interpretable through naked eyes, this reflection could provide information about the environment. Using the right combination of physics and deep learning, we show that a surprising amount of information can be revealed about the environment. For example, a building across the street. Our method takes input as RGBD video from a consumer-grade sensor. We start by reconstructing a 3D model of the scene using Kinect Fusion and compute the diffuse texture using an existing method. The basic idea is to model specular component of each viewpoint using material-specific environment maps that present incoming lighting convolved with specular BRDF. The specular highlight of a viewpoint is rendered by reflecting the camera array about the surface normal and simply looking up the direction in the specular environment map. This forward model allows us to optimize for the specular environment maps that best reproduce the ground truth input views. Because there are many different materials in a scene, we predict the material weight using a neural network that is trained for each scene, given a user-decided number of material bases. We can then linearly blend the environment maps using the material weighting from the network to render specular highlights. The specular highlight prediction is added to the already known diffuse component, which then provides the final prediction of the appearance. We can optimize for the pixels of the environment maps and the weights of the material segmentation network, such that the final rendering best reproduce the ground truth input images. We show our results in different scenes with varying scene configurations, materials, and lighting conditions revealing surprising amount of information from the highlights. Compared to the state-of-the-art method in lighting estimation that only recovers the general direction of lighting, our algorithm provides much more detailed estimation. Please refer to our paper for more results. Once the environment map is recovered, we can use it for a realistic re-rendering of the scene a task called novel view synthesis. The physical model of the lighting enables predicting specular highlights from an arbitrary viewpoint. Specifically, we adopt the neural rendering scheme and provides the specular and diffuse components as input to a neural network, which in turn provides realistic view prediction. The network is trained per scene using perceptual and adversarial laws. Our neural rendering approach also supports an explicit model of specular interreflections and Fresnel reflection, two phenomena that are not supported in most image-based rendering methods. The paper contains more details. This is a video showing the rendering of novel viewpoints. Please note how accurately the neural rendering predicts the specular highlights for novel view synthesis. Because we have the physical model of specular highlights, our method is especially robust at view extrapolation, predicting views far away from input views. This video shows an example where the input training views are very far from test viewpoints. As shown here, the specular highlights of extrapolated viewpoints are better predicted than the state of the arts. In this work, we introduce method to reconstruct an image of the environment and the appearance model of the scene from an RGBD video. Our contributions include a high quality environment estimation and a system that can handle non-convex multi-object scenes with spatially varying materials and modeling of interreflection and Fresnel effect. Thank you very much for listening.